Hello again from Robinettes. 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 <laughs> it rolls off the tongue. It does. Grace DeRosha. Hi. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. There is nothing scary. A Blue Cross Blue Shield dietitian. Yes. Nothing scary about what we're making today. I love the season. We're coming towards the end of the season. It's getting a little colder. Yeah, a little chilly. But this is this is a perfect fall harvest dish. I love it. What is this? And you can serve it on Halloween. Yes. Fuel up your kids before that happens. They head out. Yeah. So this is farro. What? <laughs> Those what? little fun nuggets. It's a it's a complex carbohydrate. These so little thingies right grain. there. Mm-hmm. Hi. Yeah. So it's almost looks like puff rice. Yeah. Delicious. Like Rice Krispies almost. Yes. A little bit like kind of a couscous orzo thing happening, but okay. definitely in that family. All right. So we're basically making a stuffing. To oh, stuff. Now you're speaking my language. Yeah. To make these beautiful little stuffed acorn squashes. Oh, that's what this is? Yeah. And An we're going to fill that. And you can get these at any acorn squash store? Yeah, specialty store. No, oh, any wow. store. Well, I'm, you know, it's, <laughs> I don't usually go down that part of the store. And the best thing is that they, they're they called winter squashes. Oh, okay. Like pumpkins and acorn squashes. They're cousins. Oh, there's a pumpkin here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just noticed. All related. And they're delicious. They're great. They're filled with vitamin A, beta carotene. Vitamin A is great to boost your immune so system you have to, right do you, now. Do you cook this first? Yep, cut it in half. Okay. And then you can bake it in the oven. For how long? Um, 20 to 30 minutes. So, so you, a little bit of oil. Okay, so you slice super it. Super easy. You, you gut it, you gore yep. it, you, you what, what's that called? You DC. Oh, okay. I don't know. I'm asking. <laughs> I love you. Okay, so then you, you just gut it. You just yeah, yeah, get you, in there. Get in there. You use like an ice cream scoop or, or a spoon. thingy or a spoon and just mm -hmm. get it. Get it. Okay, so it looks <laughs> like that, right? What am I going to do with you? <laughs> Wait, I'm asking. Yes, for sure. Then, so how do you so make you this make stuff? This, this, you make all of that in a pan. That is an apple chicken sausage. Oh, so nice. So yum. There's apples in there, okay. of course. You could, and you can play with it. Oh, oh my gosh, there's kale or spinach. Really? We were doing so well. <laughs> I know. Well, dark but leafy greens but are important for right, your body. But there's not a lot, is there? No, see? Okay. So now what? Do I take it and put it so in there? So you'll cook that all in a pan. What okay. else is in there? Uh, the farro, a little the bit of pharaoh. seasoning. I still can't get over that. The farro. Like an Egyptian king. I was just about to ask that. <laughs> Walk like an Egyptian. Walk like an uh, Egyptian. So this right, is, so yeah, it's great because it's like ends up being a little bowl, and all of these things are very fall harvesty available. Oh, no, it looks beautiful. At farmers markets right now, even um, apples, even spinach and kale are available. Now work right with now. me for a minute. Yes. Just hear me out. Could you do this and then? Now I'm asking for a friend. I already know what he's gonna say. Do you? Yep. Could you sprinkle just a little cheese and put it under the broiler? Oh, I thought he was going to say something else. No, could you, you put, could, yes. put a little cheese and then you just could. put it under the broiler. I thought he was going to ask if he could deep fry it. And then can you deep fry it? <laughs> don't deep fry it. But the cheese would work, right? Yeah, you could do that. But I don't think you need it. Just a little cheddar. Sure. Just a little cheddar for color. I mean, I have I have nothing against cheese. All right, let me try this real quick. But cheese, you don't have to put cheese on everything. Not everything. Just the acorn squash thingy with the with the Egyptian stuff. <laughs> yeah. Now what? Oh no! He doesn't need cheese. Where's the where's? Where's the cheese? Where's that? There's a kick. To, there's a little. What kind of spices are in this? There's not that much. Big, I mean, the onion powder, garlic. That it's good. Oh look at people are giving. People are doing this in the. Oh my there's god. It's a party. It's, They're it's doing this. It's a fall this. harvest party. It's a fall harvest party. Everyone's getting ready for Halloween. They're like, whoop, we got to get our whoop, costumes whoop. on. That also means we got to wrap it up. So <laughs> you can find the recipe to this acorn squash Egyptian cornucopia thingy on 13 on your side.